What's up guys and welcome back to another video today and today it's Friday once again well at the time of recording this it's Thursday but uh, this will be posted on Friday as you know school and stuff like that is making life a little bit harder so I uh, can't, can't post videos on Thursday when there's a brand new car so yeah uh, let's go check out the brand new mom mobile the soccer mom Crazy mobile, maybe. You know, we don't know if it's gonna be crazy or it's gonna suck. Which, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really have high hopes for this car, but hey, we don't know. The brand new 2018 Land Rover Range Rover Velar First Edition. Now, I don't know what First Edition stands for. Like, maybe in the comments you know what this is. I mean, obviously, it's the first edition of that car. So, maybe that's just what it is saying. So, I don't know. Um, the speed is 6.7. Handling, 5.8. Acceleration, 6.1. Launch, 8. Braking, 5.9. It's B-Class all-wheel drive. It's got 375 horsepower, 332 foot-pounds of torque. It's a little heavy, 4,600 pounds, which, you know, is fully expected. It's an SUV, uh, which, I'm not going to lie, these stats are not terrible for a B-class SUV. I'm not going to lie. They're not. And sh here she is. Um, yeah, looks like a normal Range Rover. Just kind of SUV. I do like this touch on the back where it says Range Rover. I don't know. I like it better. The older one that had that Range Rover symbol, I just didn't like that as much. But this is better. So obviously a lot of trunk space It is an SUV. There's the engine. Just a normal good old engine, am I right? <laughs> and obviously you can fit the whole family and go on a road trip in this car for sure because it's a fucking SUV. I mean, I don't know how many times I have to say that. Oh, wrong side. Also, one more thing. I think I I think I was told that these little gold finishes right here and stuff like that are actually real gold. I'm not going to lie. That it sounds like the biggest waste of money ever. This is like the most common SUV in rich Hollywood mom areas. I mean, why why would you waste time and money putting real gold on this? I'm just, you know, I'm going off on a rant, so I shouldn't. Very nice interior. I mean, you got to have it nice for the white moms, am I right? Hey, they might get mad that it's the wrong color, but it is a very nice one. All right. Oh, I turned it on instead of left, so... Well, there's the engine sound. Like every Range Rover engine sound. Just a normal... You can hear the turbo, that's pretty cool. Um... But other than that, it's just a normal SUV, honestly. I mean, it, it's I'm, I'm not going to lie. I don't really know why Forza brought this car into the game. It's it's, it's kind of too common and everything, and it's not really like... And nobody really asked for this. Well, hey, I don't mind it. I mean, at least it wasn't for 50%. If it was for 50%, you wouldn't see a video this week. But it's only three races, easy, done. I totally fine with this car, I'm not going to lie. I could care less if this was a new car or a car that was in the game for a long time. But, yeah. Uh, I just don't know why they added it. It's way too common. Like, we're, we're, we're here. We're looking for Lamborghinis and stuff like that in a video game. It's not really a video game car is what I'm trying to say. So, since it's an SUV and SUVs really have no other purpose in this game besides off-roading, we're going to off-road. So, nah, I don't want to do that race. So, we'll we'll do uh, just... I'll find a race. Just give me a second. You guys ready for this race? You ready to catch the manager in this race? And we're off in our catch the manager mobile. Um, uh, apparently not the best launch because that freaking Jaguar is pulling on me. 
But <laughs> I'm pulling on the Jaguar, bitch. Woo! Oh, you guys getting ready for hit this jump? Mama, Mama's coming in hot. She's gonna be late to the soccer game. There's gonna be so many jokes about white suburban moms. So many. I really do like this interior. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I can see the taste in white super or white. I almost called them white super moms. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I can see the taste. But I mean, all white moms like really nice stuff. I just realized that my mom's white, so all Karens like really, really nice stuff. I mean, my mom likes nice stuff, but like she could care less if she got a Range Rover or a minivan, so she's not really into the nice car thing. She doesn't care, but she does, she does like nice car. I'm just going to stop talking because none of this even matters and you probably don't care about it, so yeah. Is that another Range Rover or is that a Jaguar? Jaguar, BMWs, and Range Rovers are the mom mobiles. The mom, the soccer mom mobiles. And Suburbans. Oh my god, I almost forgot. About Escalades and Suburbans. Can't forget about those. God dang it. That stupid Jaguar. Do you just have more acceleration than me? Or when I crash into you, I guess I have more acceleration than you. I don't know. This thing's coming up behind me. Nope, not happening, dog. Go oh, fuck yourself. No, Jimmy's got a game. Get the fuck off my car. <laughs> I feel like this is the car that Michael's mom or Michael's wife would drive if uh, GTA got the licensing for uh, cars. Or her Audi convertible, I think it is, yeah. Taking the win in the mom. Can I just say one thing? Why is uh, this car like a challenge car? Like you had to do a seasonal event for this car. But for the Ford Ranger Raptor, it was just a brand new car that you could just buy. Like, come on. Why wasn't this thing buyable? And the Ford Ranger Raptor, which is ten times cooler. I don't know. All right, paint groups. There we go. Um... So our first paint group is this, and I already know what I want to make mine. I want to make mine red, because if I was a white mom, oh, that looks pretty sexy. And what's this? I bet it's the top. Yes, it is. Wow, that looks actually kind of cool, but kind of not at the same time. Okay, so I know not the coolest paint job, but if I was a white mom, man, this is my dream spec for VLR. Uh, yeah, but Range Rovers, you can always paint the roof, so that's good. Um, black out the rims, of course. But I tint the windows. Mom. Mom's coming in with a Sport Velar. It is the first edition for a reason. Alright. Engine swaps. I'm excited. Are we gonna get one engine swap or none? Well, we already know we're gonna get one at least, because there's an engine swap right here. Oh! Well, I did not see that coming. There's four. So we have the 5-liter uh, V8 DSC, the uh, <laughs> the Lamborghini Huracan engine, 5.2-liter V10, <laughs> a Aventador engine, 6.5-liter V12, and the racing 7.2-liter V8. Well, you obviously know which one I'm going to pick. It's this one. But man, did I n I did not see these two coming or these three. I did I especially didn't see the five o. I that I I didn't see that one coming. Like I knew if there was gonna be a V ten or a V twelve, they're gonna be they always stick together. If there's gonna if there's a V ten if there's a five point two liter V ten, there's always a six point five liter V twelve and other way around if you know what I mean. So we're going to do the V8 because we're making this an off-road vehicle because, let's be honest, who really wants to see this thing race? And we all know the answer to that. If it's going to win in a normal racing race, it's not. It's it's not going to be a good race car. And if you do want to see it race, don't watch it on this channel because AR-12 does all the crazy stuff. I just make the best thing for this car, I think, I, in my opinion. Look at that. It already has over 9 speed. It almost has 9.5 speed. It almost has 9.5 speed. A Range Rover. 
Holy shit! All right, lifted dis lifted suspension because it's an off-road car. It's we're we're lifting this bad puppy. Should we put a roll cage in it? I mean, it would protect us when we're jumping mountains, when we're Bahan, but I don't really like the look of the roll cage or the roll bar. I don't know, that's just me. I don't really like um, inside the cars, especially in like a mom mobile. I don't think that looks very good. Well, it looks like 9.4 speed is all we're going to get out of this thing, but that's totally fine. Very unexpected speed for this car. Oh, that looks really cool. <laughs> You're, I, I mean, I can't lie. That looks really cool. The off-road tires. Now, I like these rooms, but mm, we could have better. Oh, <laughs> that just looks so cool. Like, just off-road tires not meant for this car at all. I think that looks really cool. It just doesn't look like it's, it's just supposed to be there for the car. But, man, it needs to be there. That looks cool. And, yes, we get our smaller rims, 17-inch. We gotta make these things small for off-roading. Wheel spacers, all right, all right. Let me look at this. Let me look at this. Okay, not the best, but like I said in the last episode, or was it the last Forza video, uh, where I said if we didn't have wheel spacers, then everybody else would get mad. So, so more people would get mad if we didn't have wheel spacers than a not very good one. So, I'll take it. All right, all right. Honestly, I think I'm going to put that on the car. And, uh, of course, the ugly Forza front bumper. But, hey, this thing isn't a race car, am I right? It's an off-road car. Oh, 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 yep, saw that coming. <laughs> Guys, that looks so... Oh, my God, I just... I hate the oh, yeah, SUV Forza wing. It looks so bad. I don't even know why what well, they were thinking. So there that's what my beast looks like with 9.4 speed. 9.4. $115,000 later, we are now down uh 800 pounds. That is very good. And uh it's gained about 1000 horsepower. Also very good. S2 class S2 class. Holy shit, I didn't even notice that we were going that high. God damn, all right, we're S2 class. And there's the uh, V8, if you haven't heard it before, which would be very surprising because it goes on like every goddamn car in this game. Well, from that very surprising S2 class, and it has over 1,300 horsepower, uh, this thing is a little better than I thought. So, Forza... I'm sorry for kind of joshing, joshing you about putting this car in the game. So. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. All right. I mean, an S2 off-road car that can do that. Holy shit. Okay, Forza. Yep. I see you. You put a car that... To everybody thinks, oh, that's just a glorified mom mobile. But then do this to it. Wow. They totally fucked us. They knew we were going to make fun of this car until we upgraded it. This is a beast. <laughs> Alright, let's get into a race right now. I'm excited. Hey, at least it's a winter car that... Like, an off-road winter car in this race. Because, man, if it was a fucking race car... That would piss me off. Like, it would just be so annoying, like, trying to drive this during winter. Oh, my God. I'm just imagining it. Oh, fuck. It would be awful. Oh, copyright. I fucking hate this. I hate trying to talk during the copyright cutscenes. I used to just, like, skip this in the video, but I can't. Because YouTube won't let you trim the video if it's copyrighted. So, yeah. And they fucking suck at the copyright rules where anybody could copyright you for two seconds of audio. It's just so fucking broken. And YouTube never fixes it because they fucking suck at their job. Because Susan's behind the fucking wheel of this goddamn boat that's slowly sinking. 
Susan, please hire somebody else to run your fucking thing. God. I just need to do a quick YouTube hate rant. And we're off in our mom mobile. Uh, first of all, I'd be fucking scared if this thing was rolling up behind me. I mean, god damn! It would be pretty fucking terrifying. Like, just look at that roll bar. They, it's ready to kill somebody. Like, and you know Karens would if they could. They would kill somebody. Oh, shit! Uh, well, that Jeep just fucking flipped. One Karen down, three more to go. <laughs> uh, hey, I've reacted to Karens. I can say whatever I want. I'm pretty much a Karen of myself. If you watch one Karen, you get a little bit of Karen blood in it. It hurts for a second, but hey, it doesn't feel bad until you see a Range Rover or a BMW. Then it comes back to fucking haunt you like heroin. <laughs> I've never done heroin, just by the way. I, am I saying heroin right? Heroin, heroin, I don't know. I, I don't even know the drug. Can I just say meth? Meth. Alright. I've never done meth either, so. Wish I have, but. I'm just, I'm just kidding. Shit. Oh, fuck. I saw that tree. I was like, just driving. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And then I hit that jump, and I'm like, oh, there's a tree right there. Fuck. Ah, oh, there's a fucking wall. Oh, shit. I hate fucking jumps. Jumps. Wait, what? You could go through the bottom? Nobody told me this. Come on, I don't like this hill. I could have fucking came through the tunnel, are you kidding me? God damn it. Well, oh well. We'll catch up to that Eurus. It doesn't... A Eurus? You need a Range Rover, sweetheart. Because Karen's only like BMWs, Euruses... Uh, I, I just said Eurus. God damn it. Whatever. Whatever nice SUV, that's what Karen's like. So I guess a Eurus would count. But a Eurus is more sporty and cooler. I would rather have a Eurus than a Range Rover. But if my Range Rover is like this and there's a stock Eurus right over there, I would take the Range Rover. God damn. This thing's a beast. When your mom mobile turns into a off-road machine, be like... Skrrr! right into the wall now i got some control I, I in my i tried a different race guys and man i could not control this thing but i got much better control on that race so that was good and first place with the monster mom mobile uh! oh, what do you think i'm gonna say about this car that it's pretty fucking cool i'm not even joking i was fully coming into this video to make fun of it for the upgrades to suck and put a few off-road things on it just to, I mean, maybe do well, whatever, you know. But other than that, I was not expecting a cool video like this one. This, much better than what I expected. I mean, there could have been a little bit better stuff. I mean, but, I mean, they can't do much with this body kits for SUVs. Because, I mean, you can get a roll bar and lights. I mean, there's nothing else than that. It's not like a truck where you can put tires in the back and you go full off-road and everything. This is a SUV, alright? So, don't be mad at Forza if they didn't get the perfect specs. Because I sure aren't, and I sure aren't, that's English, but... Um... Yeah, but, uh... Yeah. I mean, if you want to go get this car, I would. If I were you, but... At the same time, I can totally see why you don't really want to waste your time getting this. But hey, if you're just on Xbox and you're like, you know, I feel like playing Forza right now, I would totally get this car. I mean, it's totally worth it. It's going to be worth some good money because, surprisingly, you had to do challenges for it instead of just buy it like a normal car. Because this car is valuable. I mean, I don't have a face cam, but you guys know what I'm saying when I say valuable. So yeah, one of the most uh, recognizable and just everywhere car ever has been added to Forza, and it's not half bad, I'm not gonna lie. It's really not. I mean, it has 9.4 speed, and it's a great off-road car. If you want if you want that, then here it is. Uh, the Range Rover Velar, and uh, it's gonna be worth some good money. It's 15 minutes out of your day. If you do want to get it, it's easy. Uh... I had no struggle getting it at all. Like, not even, uh, 
I don't think I rewinded in those three races at all. Like, I mean, I don't rewind all the time, but sometimes they can be difficult. But this one was just like, wow, that that was fast. Uh, oh, I already have the car. Oh, cool. So yeah, uh, if you want to get this car, I would. If I if I were you, and yeah, like and subscribe for more uh, Forza videos, as I know you guys like the Forza videos. And yeah, that's. That's the video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the uh, the Mars Range Rover because that's the title of the stream, and I thought that was clever, but it's probably not. <laughs>